Apparently, the new protagonist of Grand Theft Auto 6 is going to be a Latina female. Some say it's going to ruin the game, and others say it's not a big deal. What do I think about it? Let's find out. Of course a female can be the protagonist of a Grand Theft Auto game. I don't really see a difference. It's how Rockstar will handle it that worries me since the game is going to have less edgy humor like the other games. Because they might handle it in a way where they are trying to please the media. Which shows that they grow grown from giving the man the middle finger to being the man. Some say it's not a big deal, but this could interfere with Rockstar's writing humor. Of course having a female protagonist doesn't mean Grand Theft Auto 6 is going to be a media pleasing mush that tries not to offend people besides the bad guys. But honestly, I don't want the female protagonist going on a two minute rant about the mistreatment of women in America before killing the evil corporation man. Not saying they shouldn't discuss the mistreatment of women in America, but in a more subtle way and doesn't make the protagonist seem like a feminist stereotype. Since it was reported that the two protagonists are going to be like Bonnie and Clyde, it may not be a, a 2016 SJW compilation, but they're going to stop with the offensive humor. It could be a sign of the game will just be made to please those type of people, you know what I'm talking about. Trying to avoid mentioning the word political correctness because I'm not trying to seem like I'm owning the libtards, nor am I trying to own the Trumpies. I'm trying to say how having a woman protagonist is not a bad idea, but how Rockstar could be handling it may cost the whole game. And political correctness could get in the way of Grand Theft Auto 6 having a decent story and characters. I'm not saying Rockstar has to be racist, homophobic, sexist to be good. But they're just going to make fun of one group and not the other because it's not stuff to make fun of the other group and count me out because Rockstar made fun of everyone. For an example, they didn't just mock Christians for how some of them can come off as delusional freaks that seem like borderline cultists. They also mocked atheists for how some of them can come off as edgy narcissists who think they're better than you because they don't believe in religion. And that's what I love from Rockstar, because instead of picking a side, they just make fun of everyone. Because honestly, every group seemed like delusional, narcissistic freaks. But they're just gonna take it in the booty hole by one group, and pathetically mock the other. It'll just come off as a pathetic attempt to push a group's ideology or beliefs. Honestly, I hope they stick with the Bonnie and Clyde part, and let it have its cool moments where they rob banks instead of trying to push political correctness. Hopefully, our female protagonist isn't a pathetic attempt to push any agenda. I have hope she'll be just as great as the others.